ruined my life again. Announcing the most important... Good morning, family. Hey. Good morning, Dad. Good morning, Dad. Hey, what you reading, Junior? It's a book of baby names. I'm trying to figure out what to call my kid. Well, that's a very important decision to make. You know, kids tend to live up to their names. They do? Yeah. You don't want to put a fat, a little, or murder in their name. <laughs> gotcha. I got an idea. Why don't you name the kid after me? Why would I name my kid Dad? <laughs> huh? Ow! You know, son, if it's a girl, you can always name her Jay. Or Claire. Or Katie. Why don't you put them all three together and name a Clajady? Ew! That sounds nasty, Clajady. I wouldn't want to live up to that. Gentlemen, take out your happy dollars and come into the stage <laughs> is Clajady. <laughs> well, if you guys will excuse me, I've got some thinking to do. I've got to come up with a name. I'll help you. Hey, is that all you have for breakfast? Yeah. I'm going to go down to the club and work on my short game. Because <laughs> you know I don't need no work on the long game. <laughs> 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 I almost forgot. You know what? We have a meeting with the insurance guy about our estate planning on Friday. I'm not going. Michael, estate planning is a necessary thing. I ever tell you the story of my Uncle Willie? The sweetest man you ever want to meet. Okay? My Aunt Lucinda was pressuring him for years to fill out a will. He's like, uh-uh. Oh, no, 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 thank you right here. My name's Willie, not Will. <laughs> <laughs> Finally... <laughs> He gave in to the pressure. He goes downtown, he fills out the paper, walking out the office, a window washer on the 50th floor sneezes. His filling pops out of his mouth, flies down 50 stories, penetrates Uncle Willie's skull, lodges itself between the cerebellum and medulla oblongata, kill him instantly. You know Uncle Willie's last words? Cause then I... <laughs> oh my God, Michael, did that really happen? No, but it, it could. See, why are you playing? I don't give you grief about golf, and that's very dangerous. How is golf a dangerous game? Did I ever tell you about my cousin Bertram? You got a cousin Bertram? Oh, I got a cousin Bertram. One day, <laughs> he hit a four iron 175 yards and landed on the green, went straight into the hole. Wow. In celebration, he raised up his golf club at that moment, a bolt of lightning struck the golf club, went down his arm, over his shoulder, across his chest, went down his body, around his waist, went into his back pocket, hit his lucky quarter, and blew his ass off. Wow. Yup. Hole in one. What a lucky guy. Michael! Okay, I'll do it. All right, Friday at three. All right. All right. Do la blagada. <laughs> is back, and it starts with the one-hour premiere of George Lopez. One day, we're going to put a Latino in the White House, and it'll still be white, but with blue trim. And two reasons critics are calling Hope and Faith a surefire hit. This body and these brains. The series premiere on the premiere of the new TGIF. ABC Friday, starting 8, 7 central. Hi, Mom. Uh-uh, Claire, don't hi, Mom, me. You know you're on punishment. You're not even supposed to be out your room. Dad approved this. He said I could do community service. So, I signed up to be a big sister. But you're already a big sister. No, I'm talking about the organization where older girls mentor younger girls. Come on, sweetie. I'd like you guys to meet someone. Oh. Who is uh, this? <laughs> this is Kennedy, my protege. Hi, sweetie. Hello. Isn't she adorable? Uh -huh. <laughs> she likes. This is wonderful. I am really proud of you, sweetie. Thanks, Mom. Come on, Candy. I'll show you my room. Okay, big sis. Come on, Candy. You want to come? No, little sis. <laughs> hey, Jimmy. Hey, Mike. How you doing? I'm good. You notice, right? I couldn't help but notice. Last time I saw you was bolder than me. That's a great rug. Uh, excuse me? No rug here, Mike. What is a weed? Come again? You get plugs? Can't hear you. <laughs> it's it's on the... 
Uh, uh. I'm just trying to uh. touch it. <laughs> Come on, you can't. Uh. Can I see? Wow. <laughs> What's the matter? I think these guys over here, they after me. Don't look at them. You talking about the golfers? Uh, golfers? That's what they want you to think. <laughs> I think it's a hero. Well, I mean, it's understandable. You see a guy with a big bush of hair like this, you're going to hate him, right? I mean, that's, that, you know, that's going to happen. You don't hate me, do you, Mike? <laughs> What's the matter with you, Jimmy? Oh, ain't nothing the matter with me. I never felt better. What you looking at, man? <laughs> Look, Jimmy, let, let's get back to the hair. Mm -hmm. What's the secret? It's called hair it is. <laughs> you mean to tell me that you took a pill and your hair grew back like that? Well, I actually bumped mine up to 10 a day because I got a high school reunion coming up. But look at me, man. I'm growing hair like a chia pet. I'm on my way to the barbershop now. <laughs> wow. I got to try this I'll take stuff. those, man. I got three boxes at home. I'll try to sneak out before they see me. Yeah. Oh my God. What, 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 what? There's hair. How much do you see? I see three strands in the oh. southeast quadrant. Oh, oh, yes, it worked. Oh, my God. <laughs> Hey, hey, Dad, Dad, I wouldn't go out and buy a hairnet just yet, but it's kind of amazing. What do you mean by that? By what? Buying a hairnet. Well, is you still... <laughs> I know I was just kidding with you, man. <laughs> I know what you mean. I know what everybody means. In fact, you mean a lot more than you think you mean, my man, Jelly Bean. <laughs> I'm lost, Dad. It doesn't matter. You know why? I got hair. <laughs> sister. What do you mean? She signed up to spend all her time mentoring some needy little girl. What about me? I can be needy. I can be needy. <laughs> there, there, my friend Grant Marshall. There's no need to worry. This is great news. It means more time for us. You don't understand, Franklin. What if your sister Rita wanted to trade to him for a new brother? I mean, what would you do? Start singing. Happy days are here again. that much, then we're just going to have to do something to keep it from happening. But how? I don't know yet. But it'll come. I'm just singing about my new love, Jay. My hair, isn't it beautiful? <laughs> no, it looks ridiculous. Oh, come on, you're jealous. Every I live in a world of hair haters, Jay. You see this hair? Look at this, baby. Northeastern quadrant, that's new growth. <laughs> you see this hair in the sub-Sahara section? Oh, that's my what's up, baby. Michael, I... No, no, no. Right here? You, 
touch the curls. They're delicate until they get their legs. I cannot believe you. So, oh, my God! Uh -uh. <laughs> oh, my God! Oh, my I got the number. Do you really think this is going to work? Of course it'll work, my love. You make everything work. You make the sun come up. You make the birds sing. You make my heart flutter. Just shut up and give me the number. <laughs> yeah. Now remember, you're a concerned parent. Be assertive. Franklin, be quiet. Yeah, yeah, just like that. <laughs> Hello? I mean... <clears throat> Hello? <laughs> Is this the big sister organization? So, of the two plans I've outlined, A is the most expensive, but it's also by far the best. <laughs> so what you saying? is if I love my family, I'd go with plan A. On the other hand, if I don't like my family, i go with plan B. That's one way of putting it. Well, here's another way. Uh, what about I just save a few bucks and go with plan C? That's where I fake my own death and run off the Rio with some hooker and liquor. <laughs> Michael. Okay, we'll go with plan B. Michael. Plan C. Michael. Plan A. Okay, plan A. I pay, I die. Your money multiply. My, 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 I feel like I'm gonna cry. You happy, Jay? You happy, 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 happy. I got a question. Something just hit me. she make if I die? In the event of your early demise, Jay would receive three million dollars. Three million dollars? <laughs> what do I get if she kicks the bucket? Twelve thousand dollars. <laughs> that doesn't seem fair now, does it? You listen to me, Fuzzy Lumpkin. I'm <laughs> not be okay. Of course I'm okay. Who said that? No offense. Forget it. None taken. Here. Take a couple of these. I'm tired of looking at that 12-inch pot on your head. <laughs> okay, before we wrap things up and get to signing papers, there's just one more decision you two have to make. Should Michael end up in a vegetative state, would you want to keep the machines on or pull the plug? Of course, pull the plug! It. <laughs> Why the, I don't know. I hate to have to cut his head off myself. <laughs> but make it pop right off, right? Yeah, well, I wish I had a sack to put over his head so he wouldn't look at me. Yeah. <laughs> okay, girl, let me get to this. All right, because uh, Michael really does love him some catfish. All right, bye.
Yeah. What do you think of my new look? You look crazy. <laughs> Good crazy or bad crazy? <laughs> right there, you need yourself open. Ooh. You look crazy crazy. That must be what they call people with long, luxurious hair. <laughs> I think it looks frightening. You look like a bad science experiment. Oh, you're just jealous because you don't have the patches look. <laughs> With that, I like it. Thank you, son. See, they just whoop! I'll step it. Martin, the food smells good. Yeah, what is it? Mmm, something special I made just for your father. Aww, Jay, always looking out for her husband. <laughs> or should I say, has been. <laughs> Here, Katie, why don't you take a bite of this? To no! Michael! <laughs> You put a little something extra in Yes! Your face. Peanut oil! She's allergic to this! The old peanut oil trick, huh? <laughs> what is wrong with you? Nothing's wrong with me, Jay. Nothing at all. And I plan on keeping it that way. You know what's your weird? The hair's not growing out of your head, it's growing into you. Don't come near me with it! I get you! Open it down! Stay back! Get your butt over here and sit down and eat this food. No, no, no. Got my dinner, Jay. <laughs> what was that? I don't know. Your father's been acting very strange lately. Yeah, I thought something was wrong this morning when they told me I should name the baby Erder. The more he grows that stupid hair, the messier he gets. You know what, Claire? You're right. Nothing. Just figured I'd come spend some time with my little sister. Finally. Do you want to play a game? Sure. What's my phone call? Ring, ring, ring. Now pick up yours. Hello, big sister organization. What's that? You have information about your daughter, Claire? She's been in rehab. She's on parole for beating up her little sister? Oh, wow, you must be able to see into the future because I didn't start beating her up until now. I'm sorry. I just don't want you to be anybody else's big sister. Look, Katie. You know how mom and dad have enough love to share with three children? Yeah. Well, I have enough love to share with you and a less fortunate little girl. So don't look at it like you're losing me. Look at it as a chance to make a new friend. Maybe you're right. <laughs> Unfortunately for you, yes, I am. Wait, Mr. Why aren't you at work? Because they're after me down there. All of them. They're after my hair. And you got them in on the scheme. Me? That's what you have. You're going to give them a little bit of insurance money after you bump me off. You know what? Look, you got to get it. Michael! Michael, where are you? Michael, will you look? I went online and found out this stuff contains THC. The hair cure. No, baby. no. This is the same stuff that's in marijuana. Taken in large amounts, it causes paranoia. Why should I believe you? Look, the recommended dosage is one a day. How many have you been taking? One. Every hour. Oh, my God. No wonder you've been acting so crazy. Yeah, but my hair looks good. No, it don't. You mean to tell me you didn't like me when I had hair? No, I didn't like you when you had hair. I hated you. I, I don't even know why I married you. But then, baby, when you went bald, I was like, woo. Like, woo, woo, woo. <laughs> and sexy, too. Sexy? Real sexy. What are you doing with the babies? <laughs> why don't you come on out of there? You be careful with that. And we can go to the doctor. Watch me, you're gonna step on it. Don't step on it. Then we can go to the barber. You're teasing me. You're teasing me. Okay. Why should I trust you? You don't know if you can trust me. 
Except for the fact that you've spent practically our entire lives together, Michael, and all I've ever done is love you. Guys, what do you think? Should we trust her? <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't like the way she's played at teens. Well, if I were you, I would listen to her because, you know, she does have a cute smile when she looks at you. Okay, Jay. Wait a second. Look, you're right. I have been feeling strange ever since I started taking those pills. Now, honestly, having hair doesn't matter to me at all. I'm very glad to hear that. Whoop! Kiss with your lips, not your hands. Is that Al Roker over there on the pogo stick? Where? He must be. <laughs> hey, Jimmy. Hey, Mike. What's happening, dude? Nothing much. Can I buy you a drink? Sure. Cool. Uh, another round, please. <laughs> See, you got you too, huh? Oh, yeah. Man. My wife had to hog tie me and drag me to the doctor to get off that stuff. Dude. They had to shoot me with the tranquilizer dart and drag me out of my reunion. <laughs> That's some bad stuff, Jimmy. Oh, I know. Hey, Mr. Hare? Oh, not these days, because you know it's heating up in the bedroom, baby. <laughs> yeah. Oh, buck why? Because of these. Man again. Wow. Any side effects? Oh, uh, none at all. <laughs> Next on ABC's Wild Wednesday, it's the two-hour season premiere of The Bachelor. Make one of these. Truly transforms people's lives. An all-new Extreme Makeover, followed by Primetime Thursday, all starting at 8, 7 Central Thursday on ABC. It's all relative Whoa. is the culture clash comedy. Don't forget to wipe your mouth with your hand. That could be the season's best. Good morning, future in-laws. Who wants frittata? What the hell is a frittata? It's all relative. Series premiere next Wednesday after my wife and kids on ABC. Bob is back and <laughs> Ah! <laughs> 